Okay, so tonight what I'm making here are vegan egg rolls. Uh, yeah, so, you know, again, this is something that takes about 20 minutes. It's a real quick, easy, and tasty. Um, it could be a snack. It could be your dinner. It's going to be my dinner tonight. So let's go, let's get to it here. So we're going to start out with, um, I, I di divided my recipe in half because I wanted to cook something prior to being on camera. So I started out with two cups of cabbage. Mm -hmm. I actually used a pre-mixed coleslaw mix because it's got the cabbage in there. It's got carrots and you know, purple cabbage as well. So two cups of green cabbage or the coleslaw mix shredded. Uh, you want to use one carrot shredded, a green onion thinly sliced, three mushrooms finely diced, two tablespoons of chopped cilantro, which is optional. I also used garlic fire. It is oh wonderful. God. Just I cooked one and tasted it. It is, oh my God, it's just the, the thing you need to have that little bit of heat. So I garlic fire, um, a half a teaspoon of salt. I used two tablespoons, teaspoons of sesame oil, four tablespoons of, instead of soy sauce, I'm using coconut aminos, um, and a teaspoon of crushed garlic, and a teaspoon of crushed ginger. So here are my ingredients. I'm just gonna go ahead and add them all. I've already pre-measured everything. It's my onions, it's my garlic and mushrooms. And you don't need a lot of the coconut aminos. I just put enough in there so that I can coat the ingredients. Now you just wanna stir this up. Now, another thing, when I first um, decided to do this today, I didn't have everything that I normally have. I didn't have the cabbage. So I looked in my refrigerator real quick. And you know, this is something you can make with whatever you have in your refrigerator. You don't have to have shredded cabbage. I didn't have the cabbage, so what I had in my refrigerator was some bean sprouts. I had some zucchini, an eggplant, and the other ingredients such as the um, the onions and the cilantro, but I actually made one with just those ingredients and it came out delicious. So <laughs> use what you like. You don't have to use these, you know, this is nice, but use what you like because I actually like the one that I cooked that already has zucchini and eggplant. And it makes it a little more crunchier you know it's a little more filling and it's really delicious so anyway i have all my ingredients mixed up here we're going to add about well, about two tablespoons of your cabbage mixture and you want it to be really hearty but you don't want to put too much in there that you can't you know you have a hard time rolling it so that's good that's about enough so you're gonna start with your roll, and again, you're just gonna flip it over and get one good solid roll in where you've got all your ingredients are already rolled in there. Now you wanna turn your edges up. I turn want your some. <laughs> <laughs> and, and then you're just gonna get some water that I have here and seal the edge, seal your little envelope. And there. And now all I have to do is pop in the fryer. So I tell you what, I decided to make it two ways. I put one in the, you don't need a lot of oil. So you only need about, they say two tablespoons of oil, but you just need enough oil to cover your pan. I fried these in a little bit of oil and they came out beautiful, right? I put this one in the air fryer. I'm going to do that. Yay. Air fryer. So when I did the air fryer, I sprayed it with mm -hmm. some um, olive oil on both sides, popped it in the air fryer. It didn't quite get as brown, but it doesn't have as much oil in it. Wow. So I, I like the, eye fr uh, the uh, air fryer idea. Yeah. So you can try it both ways, but they both work. Absolutely. And then the last thing I would do is whatever um, 
dipping sauce you're going to use, go ahead and add some Wakana culinary oil. Yeah. You can use your Delta 8 or <laughs> your regular CBD oil, but put that in your sauce. And now you've got, you've got your garlic fire. garlic fire in there, as well as you've infused your uh, dipping sauce with the oil. So here we go. Bon Thank appetit. you. Oh, yeah. Give me, I say me some. I know it's going to be crunchy and good. Yeah. <laughs> it really is. So yeah. there you go. Use what you have. Make it interesting. Make it fun. And, you know. Don't be afraid to, to try different things. That's it's right. <laughs> and it's vegan. And it's vegan, absolutely. Yes. Thank you so much, Gail. You made me hungry. I'm just going <laughs> to make me a protein shake because I had dinner already. <laughs>